Hi, welcome to Blind Owl Outdoors. I'm in Talaboon. I just dropped Shannon Murphy to meet her sister and her niece at Jollibee. I need to get some money at the ATM machine. But look at that. There's 65 people in line waiting for the one ATM machine in town. Isn't that pitiful? What a joke, huh? Took us 20 minutes to get from the municipal building to Jollibee this morning. To stop and go, stop and go, just like this right here. Just solid traffic, both lanes. People trying to pull in and out. No one will let anybody in. So the traffic is just completely blocked up. It's a madhouse. Well, I'll tell you what I'm going to do. I just got 25 pieces of bread for my micro crew. The two guys showed up today. And those pretty clouds up there. I'm going to drop my bread off for them. And I think I'll go down to Tubigan. Use one of the six ATM machines down there. Get a fish sandwich. And... Make a day of it. Sounds like a plan to me. Yeah, they need to do something here in Talaboon about traffic. Huh? Uh, it won't be so bad when they get the back road open back up again. It's all still under construction behind the altars there. But and if they were real smart, they'd make this road here one way two lanes in and the other one two lanes out and I don't know what they're going to do when they do their land reclamation stuff and make it into a regular they're going to try to make it into a city here <laughs> they need to do something with their roads that's for sure I mean you got 10,000 10,000 vehicles coming into a town and you got 17 or 18 parking spots uh, it doesn't really make a lot of sense does it Well, they got a new mayor now, so maybe she's on the ball and she'll straighten it out. Hard to say. Real hard to say. We've met her a couple times before. She owns a furniture store outside of town. He knows her, I think. Well, it's pretty nice out today. It's getting hot already. It's about 9.30 in the morning, quarter to 10. A lot of clouds in the sky today. There was a couple sprinkles in Talaboon. I guess there was a real bad accident up here by Tong Halagi, up past where George lives at, yesterday. The girls all had it, went out and they went on to a feeding out in the islands, sponsored by their friend Heidi from California. And on their way home from Talaboon, they saw a real bad accident where a motorcycle hit a truck head on. They didn't see the accident, they saw the aftermath, the puddles of blood and the crowds and stuff. The wrecked truck and the motorcycle broke completely in half, so was, obviously someone died there, no doubt. Uh, the highways are getting a lot, a lot more crowded, so I'm assuming we're going to start seeing more and more accidents. Guarantee the drivers aren't going to be getting any better. It seems like everyone's in a hurry for some reason. I don't know why. 
you're in a hurry to go nowhere. I just try to go nice and steady and be nice to average about 40 miles an hour when you go for a trip somewhere, but it's pretty tough to do. Some days it sure does seem slow. We went to the city the other day. We made good time going, going there and coming back. It wasn't bad at all. But the 